Hey, this is sixth grade health chapter three review, chapter three review. And I think what I'll do is I'll just ask the different questions and you can see how many you can get right. All right. Um, have your mom or you can text me, message me, whatever you all do and let me know how many you got right. So um, that'd be good. Sorry. This is hard to look at myself sometimes on this thing. All right. So um, where you grew and developed inside your mother's body the womb. Um, the lifeline that transported oxygen and nutrients from your mother's blood to your own. Umbilical cord. Um, what functioned as your kidneys, lungs, and intestines before you developed these organs? Placenta. And just a little quick thing, because sometimes people mix up the placenta and the umbilical cord. Um, notice that on the um, placenta there it functioned as certain um, organs before you develop the organs and then the umbilical cord has to do with the transport between your mother's blood and your blood so um, organs placenta umbilical cord blood that kind of helps you to be able to differentiate the two All right um let's see here movements that are learned movements that are learned your motor skills um, the basic unit of the body, the basic unit of the body is the oh, sorry, cell. Yes, it is the cell. All right. Um, the outer layer that protects the cell, that is the cell membrane. Um, what are the little organs that do all the work of the cell? Organelles. I'm sure you're getting all these right. What is the most important part of the cell, the control center of the cell? That is the nucleus. What is um, the largest part of the cell? It's like a thick fluid um, inside the cell that holds everything in place. Cytoplasm. All right, so cell membrane, cytoplasm, organelles, and the nucleus. All right, and then um, we talked about the tissues to body, so let's just do that. Um, tissues make up I'm sorry, let's go back to cells. Cells make up, yes. Tissues make up, yes. Organs make up, yes. And systems make up the body, all right? So cells to tissues, tissues to organs, organs to systems, systems to body. Make sure you have that for sure. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. What holds molecules of DNA? It's the blueprints which contain all the information necessary to build a cell. You had that one of your quick checkup questions there. That's chromatin, chromatin. All right, then we'll talk about um, systems, heading into the different systems. Um, what system is responsible for the production and distribution, making and distributing of hormones? Yes, it's the endocrine system. And um, what are those chemical messengers that the endocrine system produces? Hormones, yes, hormones. And they're produced by what kind of glands? Endocrine glands, endocrine glands, yes. All right, um, so the different types of endocrine glands. All right, so what is the master control gland? Pituitary gland, pituitary gland. Which gland is responsible mostly for metabolism? The thyroid, the thyroid. Which um, gland is responsible for the sugar in regulation in the blood? Islets of Langerhans. Where are the islets of Langerhans located? In the pancreas, yes. And what do they produce? Insulin and glucagon, insulin and glucagon, good. And if you don't have um, enough insulin, what's it gonna lead to? Diabetes, yes. All right, so then you have, um, let's see here, what is, uh, it secretes um, melatonin, which isn't in the book, but I told you about that. And it is your sleep, it regulates your sleep cycle, it regulates your sleep cycle. That is the pineal gland, pineal gland. Um, what are the reproductive glands concerns with um, conception development of babies? That's the gonads. Um, what is your fight or flight system, your emergency systems, their, um, 
that produce ad adrenaline. Adrenal glands, yes. So hopefully you guys are getting that. <clears throat> Let's go back over the quick checkup there on page 63 just to kind of help review a little bit more. Your body's chemical messengers they encourage your certain cells to work more or less. Hormones. The system that controls the production and distribution of chemical messengers. Endocrine. The gland that controls the other glands and also causes your body to grow. Pituitary. The gland that controls the rate of chemical reactions in your body. Thyroid. The gland that helps you react quickly in an emergency. Adrenal glands. The gland that serves as your body's alarm clock. Pineal gland. And then the gland that is found in your pancreas that helps your body maintain the proper levels of sugar, blood sugar. And that's islets of Langerhans on the pancreas, in the pancreas. Um, and then the glands that make production possible, reproduction po possible. And that's gonads, gonads. All right, so um, that will help you. Go ahead and um, continue to look through that for spring break. You're free for me. Um, basically, uh, you can review over um, the last two weeks some um, because you don't want to lose it all um, you can review over some of these um, review let review um, YouTubes and that'll help and um, I hope you have a good spring break and hopefully we can see you later